Hey guys, how's it going? Daniel here, and this is part two of some great iOS 15 extensions that I have currently found um, over the past week. So m many of you liked uh, the first video that I did of some great iOS 15 extensions that you could go and download in the first week. So this is part two of that video since I found some other great extensions that might you might like and enjoy. So let's get started. So the first uh, extension is called Dark Reader. So Dark Reader, just like Noir, turns any web page into dark mode. But what makes uh, Dark Reader a little bit different than Noir is the customizational themes that you can have. So you can actually customize your dark mode themes in uh, with Dark Reader. So you can have a darker, uh, a dark purple theme uh, for your web page, which is, makes it really fun. And there's like about 16 themes they could choose from. So there's a few themes that you could do and customize for your own experience to have on the web on Safari, which is really neat. And also just like Noir, um, it forces all, like I said, it forces all web pages that don't support dark mode to support dark mode thanks to that extension. Next we have is Tweaks for Twitter. So Tweaks for Twitter is an interesting uh, extension for users that use Twitter on Safari. Um, I'm not one of those users. I use it mostly, of course, I use the Twitter app on the iPhone. But what makes uh, Tweaks for Twitter really, really neat is that it hides so some of the features that many people don't like on the web, uh, on the web or on the app as well. So like one of them is stop promoted tweets. So pretty much it stops showing you uh, Twitter ads on your feed, um, which is really, really great. Um, it will hide trend columns as well. So that's the uh, column area on the right side of your t Twitter feed. Um, so it will be blank and it will also hide suggested follows. So if you don't want to see suggested follows, then you could just turn that feature on and it will stop showing you people that you, it will stop showing, it will stop showing you people that Twitter thinks that you should go and follow, or maybe they're promoted to go and follow, uh, to, to, for them to follow you, if that makes sense. So yeah, it's just a really, really cool feature. And there's a ton of other more features in Tweaks for Twitter as well that I didn't talk about, but those are the more popular ones right now. There's so much more that you can choose from to make it your own uh, and to have your own Twitter experience on the web. So if you're one of those users that use Twitter on the web on Safari, then this app extension might be for you. Next we have is Momentum. So Momentum is a cool Safari extension that if you're a Safari user and you use Safari every single day on the iPad or iPhone, then you're gonna love this extension because it shows you beautiful images when you open up a new tab. It, but it doesn't just show you beautiful images and the weather, it, sh it welcomes you with like the time and the clock as well. And it welcomes you with some inspirational, motivational quotes, um, which is really nice. But what makes this extension really cool is that you can actually add to-dos also in the extension so that it will show you when you open up a new tab in Safari or when you open up Safari, it will show you what you need to get done throughout the day. So if you're a busy person and you just want to like, and sometimes you just want to have something really beautiful to look at, then I recommend you use this extension because it has some great wallpapers. And like I said, it you could customize it to make it your own. Um, and it will just show you all your tasks that you need to get, that, that you need to get done. Now the extension and app is download, you could download for free, of course, from the app store. But what makes this a little bit different is that you cannot, it, what makes this different is that there is an in-app purchase as well. So it's about $40 and it unlocks some more premium uh, features as well, which is really neat. But a lot, of the, uh, a lot of the features I just talked about are free already that you can just go and download right now. And next and not least we have is a picture pipe uh, Pfeiffer. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. So it is uh, 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 an extension that forces videos on the web to automatically turn into picture in picture, which is really cool. Um, so even if videos that don't support it before, um, you can actually just, uh, you can run the extension if you see a video on a web page that you're looking at and you want it to have picture in picture, you could just run the extension and it will automatically force that video into picture in picture. So even videos that like before don't support it, you could just force it now with this extension, which, which is really neat. So you could be doing something else like going on Twitter or something and you could be watching this video because uh, of the extension you forced it to go into picture in picture, which is really, really neat as well. 
So that's pretty much it for the part two of some great uh, iOS 15 extensions for Safari that I highly recommend you guys go check out. If you guys haven't gone and check it out, then I will like, I'll have the list of all these extensions I just talked about so, so that you guys can go and check it out. And that's pretty much it. And as always, if you guys really enjoyed this video, it would mean the world to me if you guys will hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, and as always, I will see you guys later. Peace.